today I am going to talk about what I want you to consider before buying this G-Shock MTG B2000 watch. This one has a lot of different models and comes in a lot of different colors, but uh, the functionality is the same. And uh, it has things like solar, charging, Bluetooth, atomic timekeeping, alarm timer, date, day, yeah. Almost everything you can think of uh, is here in the light, as you can see. Uh, so let's just go straight into it. Uh, so when in waiting so the first thing here is the bracelet and I gotta say the the case is perfect it's so good but the bracelet is so flimsy and you can listen to this I will bring it back here to the mic and you get these kind of uh, I don't know, rattling, not rattling sound, but this other whining sound when you wear it. And I think the links are really loose. Just look at this. I think a, a better job could have been done to the bracelet. But luckily for me, this BDE version has a strap included, a rubber strap. So I might, after a while, change it out with the strap because this bracelet is really flimsy and it also has this resin I, I can't complain about the resin inside there it's a comfortable uh, very comfortable bracelet but it's not of the quality you would expect of a thousand dollar plus watch but the case is really nice and the finishing is great it's great. It has this cool look. It seems like it transitioned from completely glossy to rougher uh, the closer you get to the middle of the bracelet. And it's it's really cool. Uh, another thing that I'm really disappointed about is the second hand. It's... I think you can see it already here on camera, if I get to focus, that it's not aligned. And uh, when you pay this much money for um, for a watch, uh, you should have an aligned second hand. So I, I'm not sure if you can see it here, but it does not align perfectly with the indices, which is a bummer. Uh, another thing is you can connect it to the phone, but if you want to use the timer or the alarm, you have to set it in the phone by Bluetooth and that is it. You cannot change it on the fly, which is really disappointing. Or at least I tried to, to look in the manual and find out how you can do it, but uh, there's nowhere where you can find that information. So I have to set it manually. And also in the app, it's just one alarm and one time for the timer I, I i think that's really strange it's really strange because i have the this ga2100 and here i got it's not probably not easy to see with the negative display for you but here i got five alarms if i want and i also there's one timer but i can change it on the fly so i am not sure Let's see if you can see it, but here I can change it uh, up and down. Now it's six, five, five minutes here. I can change it and press back and then I can start it here for five minute countdown. And that's a super useful feature that I use almost daily when cooking food or something. Just changing the timer and also the alarm is you can change it on the fly and this forces you because you don't have a Bluetooth connection on this GA2100. But that this $1200 watch does not have this functionality is, I don't know. Or if it's hidden and I'm just stupid and don't understand it, but uh, I've looked through the app and also to, on the instruction I cannot find it anywhere where you can actually 
said it. So thank you for watching and hopefully I've helped you make your decision.